Sometimes it's not easy to talk about the war. Instead, we talk about Okinawa's beauty, the friendly people, or shopping possibilities. That may draw the tourist, but Setsuko Inufuku takes you on a tour of understanding. Before uh, see, I didn't care anything, you know, about Okinawan culture and history. School don't teach us. They also parents never mentioned to me. So I think anybody who comes to Okinawa, they have a right to know the true story. And I have obligation to tell the true story as much as I can. On a battle sites tour, you'll stop at Okinawa's Prefectural Peace Memorial Park Museum. Old weapons, pictures, documents, and personal accounts from survivors of the war seem to say this is what really happened, this is what the war was like. I thought that it would be more important not just to see all the beaches and all the wonderful things there. Those are fun, but if you're going to spend any time anywhere, I think it's real important to understand the cultural aspect. And being a military man, of course, the, the Battle of Okinawa is fascinating. The relationships between the Japanese and the Okinawans, we all have a feel for that, but until today I didn't realize just how intense the relationship was and how oppressed the Okinawans were compared to the uh, Japanese themselves. It's, it's really, really a fascinating tour, emotional. Our next stop, Mabuni Hill, where many Okinawans perished during the war. Now a golf course and other development may soon take over the site, but it won't erase the memories. We should have spoken long before. It's too late now. And it's hurting me. I always see the people who die from the cliff. They should have, they should have not have taken in southern area. Mm -mm. Can you see the, can you play the, over the hill? I don't think so. As you come to know the history of Okinawa and its people, you can understand their need for peace. Professor Masahida Ota, author of The Battle of Okinawa, explains his feelings on the subject. What I saw in the battlefield, it was really beyond my uh, explanation. And when I went through all these uh, ordeals, I made up my mind that the, if I could survive, I would write about why we had to go through this kind of ordeal, particularly local people, uh, non-combatants were killed by the friendly army. I watched this myself. You know, we did not know anything about war, but we were educated to sacrifice our lives for the emperor and for the nation. So we simply followed uh, without any question. The Okinawan people have suffered, and it's not easy to talk about the war, but they aren't bitter. They want your friendship, and all you have to do is get to know them. That's a song of the Nishin Yogushi. Try a battle sites tour offered by Kadena Schilling Leisure Resource Center.